good morning guys. Uh, I am sitting outside for a little bit. I thought some sunshine would maybe make me feel a little bit better. Um, I had a rough night. I was up most of the night puking and mopping my floor. It was not fun. Um, my gastroparesis is in a glare. So this always happens the week before my cycle begins, which I know is TMA to my guys. I apologize, but I think it's a really important thing for my health, so we're going to talk about it. Uh, but I feel like it always wipes my body out completely. Like, total immune system shut down. Just gone. Um, because my gastroparesis flares, I woke up with thrush, which I... I've had a sore throat the last few days, so it makes me wonder if it's been building. I wish I'd have caught it sooner. Um, but so, I woke up with thrush, woke up with a gastro flare, um, woke up with facial swelling. I don't know if you could tell, but my eyes are pretty swollen. Um, my forehead is a little swollen. I took some Benadryl, so hopefully that will help. Boys went to the bank. Ooh, that wind. That was nice. Uh, the boys went to the bank. And then JJ was going to bring me home an icy. Um, I'm a slightly addicted, but mostly it just makes my throat feel better. And my sinuses. Pretty sure I have a sinus infection or I need sinus surgery again. Um, got all the official dates for my dental work. Um, so, next week we meet the anesthesiologist. Um, <clears throat> Wednesday I meet to get my dental impressions done. Um, and then on the 9th of May, I will have all my teeth pulled and a fresh set of pearly whites put in. Um, I'm really excited. Uh. So I've been a bad vlogger. I have no vlogs up. I'm going to be working on the combo blog, I think, for the last few days. But I really don't feel like it. So if this is the first video you see in a few days, then I didn't get the other vlogs up. But if it's not, then you should go check out the other vlog. Um, we are also still working on the store launch stuff. Um, the yard sale kind of put us a little bit behind what I wanted to be. I didn't realize I would be quite so busy. So we're a little behind. Um, we're going to shoot for this Friday. Um, <clears throat> a little more went into it than I initially thought, so gotta roll with the bunches and Friday. This Friday is the tentative launch date for our store. Today, I will be posting an update that talks about what you have to do to get an entry into our giveaway as our launch for our store. So, I will be sharing that info today as well. Um, yeah, so that's really it for right now. Um, I'm going to lay out here for a little bit longer. And, I don't know. Um, I kind of want to nap. I did manage to get my floor swept and mopped this morning. Yay! Um, got all my meds done. Um, took some extra vitamin C this morning to see if I can't rev up my immune system a little bit. Um, and then I have some, I have my diffuser going. 
with some germ fighter, sweet orange, and frankincense. So, when I head back inside in a little bit, I'll, uh, turn that back on. And hopefully, hopefully I can boost my immune system a little bit more. Um, and I'll feel better. Oh, I want to tell everybody, see that bad boy right there? I don't even know if you can see it. Let's see. Oh, wrong zoom. Okay, I think you guys should be in the frame. That bad boy with the basket, that is my new bike. Thank you so much to everybody who participated in the LuLaRue fundraiser. Um, because of you guys, I now have a bike. Um, and a basket to put my oxygen tank. Uh, I'm thrilled. We're going to try to go on our first bike ride tonight. Uh, since we just got them last night. It really wasn't an option by the time we got home. But, thank you everybody so much. Um, I had a few dental costs I had to cover. But, amazingly enough, the insurance covered the rest of it. So... I was able to buy a bike, I was able to get me a few new oils, and um, I was able to order my probiotics. So thank you guys so, 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 so much for your help um, with my medical stuff. The, the cost every month for my out-of-pocket, uh, for my prescriptions is about $65,000 with insurance. Um, covering most of that. Oh look, look who's home. Um, and we pay co-pays and then on top of that I have supplements and those can add up pretty pricey. Um, right now it costs about $300 a month um, in supplement cost. So all your donations help go to that. Um, I also am going to try to get this week to a salt cave therapy appointment and um, I am also going to try to get in with a chiropractor <coughs> next week and see if those don't also help boost my immune system so well JJ just got home thank you baby icy time is the baby asleep yay I thought I'd vlog for the morning say hi world well, I guess I'm going to get off of here, and um, I think we're going to go do a little online shopping. We have a couple, we have like three or four more little purchases to make, and we will be completely ready to take the RV on the road. 100% packed and ready to go. So, we're going to go do that, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye, y'all. So we decided to come eat, uh, what is it, Yamato? Uh, Yamato. Yamato. It's Japanese steakhouse. Um, the kids are all fascinated right now. When we came in the door, we stopped by the little quarter machines. I got a bat girl. But she switched. She kind of looks weird. She, she um, switched. She switched with me. We got me. a dog, a skunk dog. A soapy dog. Yeah, we got a skunk oh. dog. We got uh, a little Napoleon Stewie, <coughs> and Olivia got this little Minecraft Minecraft character. guy. Well, mommy switched mm. with me. Oh, and Isaiah got a ball. Mama switched with me. We don't get out enough. Family. Mama switched with me, so she got this, and I got this. No, we really don't get out very much. <laughs> we don't. We tend to stay at home because it's just cheaper. Yeah, right. I can steaks. get steak. I can get steaks and go home and cook them, and I like the way I cook my steak. Right. We decided to come out. You guys, it's our first time, Maisley. It is our first time coming here. Yeah, it's our first time coming here. We just, but it's not why we decided to come out. We only decided to come out because Mom wanted to get out of that. Yeah. It was all money. Yeah. She didn't lay anything out for dinner because we were going to have leftovers. She didn't want nothing that was in the fridge. That's all I come down to. <laughs> I didn't. And I figured if I didn't want it, y'all didn't want it either. But we're going to go eat. We'll show y'all our food when we get it.
So, mommy's about to try sushi. Can I, I be a big wuss? Mm -hmm. No, no, you have to eat it. You have to eat it. You're the one always hollering, trying to eat you put it in your mouth and go. I always, uh -huh. I just tried the ginger for you. The candy ginger was good. So was that actually. Oh, it's got like real fish eggs on. <laughs> you don't taste the fish egg. <laughs> <laughs> Just put the whole thing in there and go. Go. Do. Looks that way. You at least eat the crab in it. The crab's good. You gotta put the whole thing in there at once. Just go. Just do it, mommy. The whole thing. Do it. No. Uh, I drive it. I drive it. You don't want to know it's you got to try a new thing. I'm trying it. It's delicious. I'm not eating the one you ate. It only has, it has no crab in it. Eat it. It has no crab in it. <coughs> I'm not eating it because it has no crab in it. But we have soup. I got a bocce chicken with veggies. Very good. We got soup. She dropped Olivia the chicken. got sushi. She dropped chicken into the soup. Isaiah got chicken and french fries, but he's not eating anything. And JJ got shrimp and chicken hibachi. What is this and chicken? And he got miso soup with kelp and tofu in it. And let me tell you, back when me and JJ got together like five years ago, he didn't even eat vegetables. Much less anything that was healthy for him. And now he's all about eating healthy, trying new food, and I'm very proud of him. Well, well, I'm sure. well I love sushi. And my mama over there does not I think you tried it. At least I tried it. Gotta lead by example. Yeah. Hey guys. I decided to close the vlog out for the night. We are home and settled in bed. Dinner was good. Uh, Olivia loved it. And uh, it was a good night out for all of us. We really, I think we really needed it. Um, so now we are getting settled in bed. Uh, I'm so proud of Olivia. She made a 100 on our spelling test. And uh, that's a big deal because she really struggles in reading and spelling. And she has been working all year long to get a good grade. And really, a lot of times she makes F's and D's despite the fact that she does extra homework. And we practice her words. And she just really struggles in it. So she has worked really hard to get a 100. I told her when she started getting hundreds, she could do less of my homework that I give her on her spelling words. So she was excited to only have to do three homework spelling assignments this week from her teacher versus the usual five. Um, plus, no writing them five times each. <coughs> so uh, I'm just really proud of her. But it's been a pretty good day. I think I'm feeling some better towards bedtime but it's kind of crappy when my days are like that I think getting out of the house really helped make me feel better so sorry about that my memory was full um, but I guess we're going to get to bed and uh, hopefully not wake up late tomorrow although I don't have any appointments tomorrow I missed my palliative care appointment this morning so I had to reschedule it for next week. Definite bummer. Um, but hopefully I, I don't wake up late. And Olivia's not late to school this morning. Or this coming morning. So uh, I hope everybody has a great night. And a good day. Because it will be day when you see this. And uh, I will promise I will do a much better vlogging this next week. So I will talk to you guys later.